congestion in urban areas and traffic jams are becoming increasingly serious problems in modern society, which also have negative influences on the environment. In the future, large-scale events at locations such as sports stadiums, which attract thousands of spectators, can be expected to cause transportation and roads to become even more congested compared to present-day conditions. All those cities with congestion relief as an objective are in the process of expanding their infrastructures with new routes and road widening schemes. The main focus of Fujitsu is human. We use ICT to mitigate congestion through the optimization of human movement. Congestion and traffic jams occur when too many people choose to use the same transportation modes and routes, and particularly when many people depart and return home at the same time. For example, let's say a particular time is chosen by a large number of people to use trains for their journey home. We change people's behavior using optimally designed incentives, evenly distributing their movements over various transportation modes and time slots. We facilitate movement to relieve congestion by supporting people's decision-making during high congestion situations via many different methods, including smartphones, digital street signage, and car navigation systems. These devices are used to offer optimally designed options, including information about transportation modes and routes, levels of congestion, places for travelers to drop by until departure time, and incentives such as coupons for those places. These suggestions, which are welcomed by people, also contribute to the reduction of congestion. If people are given congestion alleviating options, according to their personal preference, they reduce traffic almost without realizing. Let's take a look at people's behavior at the end of an event. Since congestion is significantly reduced after 90 minutes, we offer incentives to affect travelers' movements, such as coupons for a cafe to spend time at for a while on their way home. In this way, proposing methods to distribute traffic over different transportation modes and time slots reduce the overall amount of congestion by 20%. Let's continue and take a look at an example of highway traffic. Similar to the previous case, we presented people who would be willing to wait at a fun location en route to avoid a traffic jam with coupons for tourist attractions. Overall, our incentives contributed to a 17% reduction in congestion. This technology is used by Fujitsu's enabler of behavior analysis and mobility optimization, Spatial. Spatial gathers big data, such as transport data, behavior data, and open data, and processes it in real time to take the most appropriate actions in the present and make predictions for the future. Providing people with options that benefit them and contribute to the reduction of congestion through those actions. This is where the innovation that Fujitsu constantly aims for can be found. Fujitsu, shaping tomorrow with you.